information. No, does anyone here know what climate change is? Climate change scale out in the World Park and Slowly Dying Canyon need to be protecting the land we walk on and the water that flows to the rivers and the ocean. Not protecting the earth has led to biodiversity loss and uh, done a negative dose of evolution. This is Keep Your Parrot. Keep Your Parrot has been living in his habitat peacefully and so as days went by, it got hotter and hotter and hotter. Now, he had to relocate to survive because he can't live in his habitat anymore because his heat is gone because it's too hot to find the earth. So, now, imagine being he. Imagine being he where you have no food. Where would you go? How would you live? According to the International Union for Con Conservation and Nature, climate change currently affects at least 10,967 species of fish and the water. On the IUCN ranking of seven species, increasing the likelihood of extinction. <coughs> and according to the USC Research Institute's goal of eliminating animals and leaving their homes and serving cooler climates as a planet would, in fact, roughly half of the world. 4,000 species are on the menu migrating to low forest cooling climate. This is where the nature group comes, where nature comes in. My, um, as a person who cares for the environment and lives and lives with Earth, not wanting to see the world end, I chose an organization that has ways that can hold so we can get back to nature. My goal here today is to present to you background information about the Nature Conservancy goals to conserve nation, na nature, solutions to become a better world, and ways you can make a difference to the world around us. I also hope that by the end of my presentation, everyone listening here will be aware of the positive effects of the Nature Conservancy and will be willing to donate or volunteer to help the world reduce climate change and biodiversity loss. The Nature Conservancy, or in short, CNC, is a nonprofit organization founded in 1951. It, has, it consists of one plus million members it has impacted it has impacted conservation in 79 countries, 37 by direct conservation impacts, and 40 through through 42 through partnerships, and as well as across every state in the United States. Now, goals of the CNC um, they reduce they hope to reduce or store three gigatons of carbon dioxide emissions yearly. They want to benefit 100 million people, conserve nearly 10 billion acres of ocean. 1.6 billion acres of land. They also want to conserve more than six, 620,000 miles of river and support 45 million industries. One of the issues that I want to address today is climate change. So from ways that the CNC has thought of ways to help tackle climate change is number one, reduce or store CO2 emissions. Because with the power of nature and strength of policy and markets, three billion metric tons of carbon will be reduced or stored yearly. Maximizing nature's ability to store carbon by conserving forests and wetlands, adding regenerative regenerative practices to agriculture and planting trees, we're, we're, un we're unleashing nature's full potential to stabilize the climate. The main reason why we need to do this is because nature's major role in regulating the climate is by storing car carbon dioxide. Cultivating a shift to planet-friendly food systems and protecting the ocean, land, ocean, land, and fresh water. Um, according to the Nature Conservancy, food demand is expected to increase more than 50% in, in the next 30 years as the world's population continues, continues to grow. This is just this is just a look at what regenerative food. Um, conserv the Nature Conservancy will also like to provide food and water to those who. And regenerative food systems. Um, regenerative food systems help farmers, fishers, and ranchers to restore nature by doing what they do best, providing people with food. What exactly would this look like? On land using crops between harvest and planting crops without tilling the soil helps resort, restore the complex soil biology that farmers need to produce food for many years to come. This also reduces greenhouse gases, gas emissions, and water pollution. Aquaculture. Aquaculture is the practice of 
avoid food in the water, which is a huge benefit if done correctly. For example, seaweed. It stores carbon and helps fight climate change without leaving the sea bed. This is just a look of what Virginia's food systems can offer as they actively embrace the diversity that makes food so much more than eating. Now, Virginia's food system is a win-win cycle because it helps secure, it helps secure the global food supply, it protects our water, and it increases biodiversity and tackles climate change all at the same time. I know you're just dying to see the ways you can get, the way you can be helpful to the world around you. You can donate money. This is the site where on the, but when you scan the QR code, it brings you to this site where you can donate any amount of money that you want to, or you can get on a monthly plan. You can visit a nature preserve, and by visiting a nature preserve, you're able to see protected lands that host rare plants and animals that serve as living laboratories for conservation. You can become a volunteer, and by volunteering, you can help other preserves or you can plant a tree. Can take an action pledge and by signing an action pledge um, signing an action pledge will make your voice heard on urgent urgent issues facing the planet or you can attend an event and by attending an event this means you get to go on a guided tour on one of the preserves or you can join a virtual event um, to connect with others now that you know the motive behind what the tnc wants to achieve our mission to preserve land conserve lands and water on which all life depends and our vision where the diversity of life thrives and people act to preserve nature for its ability to fulfill our needs and enrich our lives. I hope that this information has reached everyone's buttons and want to volunteer or help in any shape or form. Your help can change the future of the world that we live in. The real question is, are you willing to be the one to